What's going on YouTube, Geosnora here. In today's video, we have an update to Nugget, a software that allows you to customize your iOS, even on iOS 18, 17 and stuff like that, and on newer devices as well. We're gonna talk about this new update in a couple of seconds. This video is brought to you by Rayboot, a software that allows you to easily fix your device if it's stuck in recovery mode, DFU mode, boot loop, and so on. Check the program out in the link below. So as you're probably aware, Nugget is an application that allows you to easily customize various parts of your device without being jailbroken, but it does allow you to have some jailbreak-like tweaks. For example, you can enable various features that are not available on your device, like boot chime and dynamic island on any device. You can enable iPhone 10 gestures on iPhone SEs, change the device model name. You can enable EU stuff, for example, side loading, disable wallpaper parallax, enable stage manager, collision SOS, a lot of features. And you can even disable diamonds or demons like OTA and game center and you know various other things. So let's go ahead and see what this new version brings. The new version is version 4.2.2 which was released three days ago and this one added seven new demons to disable it's the health kit airprint assistive touch icloud internet tethering aka personal hotspot passbook spotlight voice control and it also fixed issue where sparse restore tweaks would not apply when applying demons fixed mobile guest old label from showing on unsupported versions and as you can see it's available for both mac os on intel and arm platforms and also for windows now this one comes in an application format for your computer uh, this one is the macOS version. And once you connect your device, you have in here a couple of options, including a mobile guest alt. This would be the tweaks that require that file. So you can set here the subtype and you can enable boot time, charge limit, tap to wait. You have enabled stage manager, enable Medusa or iPad multitasking. Allow iPad apps on iPhone, disable region restrictions, for example, the shattered sound. And then, of course, you can go to springboard options where you have a couple of things like the lock screen footnote that you can set, disable lock after respring, disable low battery alert, screen dimming, show supervision text on the lock screen, and so on. You have internal options that you can enable, for example, metal HOD debugging and show build version in the status bar, play sound on paste, and other kind of things. And then you have demons in here that you can um, essentially disable. And this is actually nice because if you disable, for example, the OTA daemon, you will disable updates. It will stop trying to get updates. So screen time monitoring features, disable usage tracking agent for more privacy, I imagine. And you have Game Center over here for background services, iCloud and AirPrint and whatever. You can do so, you can um, enable or disable them and then you apply the changes. This does require the uh, mobile guest alt file. There is a tutorial on how to get the mobile guest alt file in my article about Misaka X, which is a similar tool that has similar tweaks, though it has fewer tweaks than Nugget. It looks kind of similar, as you can see from here, based on the same kind of vulnerabilities like sparse restore. And in here, you can also find the how to extract the mobile guest alt file. I do have a full article about this on my website, so definitely go ahead and check it out. That's basically it. Thank you for watching. Go ahead, get the update. It contains brand new stuff. This way you can customize your iOS device even without being jailbroken. Till next time, subscribe to stay updated and peace out.